Tonight the music seems so loud I wish that we could lose this crowd Maybe it's better this way We hurt each other with the things we wanna say We could have been so good together We could have made this last forever And now let's go dance with me Baby, if I'm never gonna dance again Guilty feet, I've got no rhythm Though it's easy to pretend I know you're not a fool Should've known better than to cheat a friend And waste the chance that I've been given So I'm never gonna dance again The way I dance with you Oh, oh. Rest in peace, George Michael. That song, me belting out that song at age seven. I think back at those times and I'm like, girl, girl, what are you doing? Did you know the lyrics to the song you were singing to? Anyway. <laughs> Hello everybody, my fairy loot box arrived. This is the November box, which is interesting because it actually arrived like a week after my October got box got in here and I'm just shook it because I'm like, that was so fast. That was so fast and this, this is the reason why you all are getting two unboxings in a row because the November box Im arrived immediately after the October box. So let's get into it. This is what the box looks like from the... <laughs> great start why am i cheering okay so see sometime two years ago because it's been two years sometime two years ago fairy loot sent me my coffee mug that is the mug i have been using it has a quote from tara murphy's um shatter me series um i spent my li my life um is it i spent my life folded between the pages of a book, right? And I love that mug. I use that mug. It's a bamboo mug. It's biodegradable. Like, so many. That mug is one of my favorite. And, like, my very good friend, Brittany, was like, yo, Noria, you have the cutest coffee mug. And now I have another mug. Ooh, 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 ooh. You can never have enough mugs, especially when they're so pretty. Very loot. Packaging, ooh, 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 ooh. she cute. J Fire Gold Travel Cup, and it's designed by Blanca Design. Like mm, you, you all, oh, and it has a cozy. I mean, it's exactly like my Shatter Me mug. Like this is exactly how my Shatter Me mug is, except for the fact, like I said, it's Shatter Me, and it's also it's it's more pink, right? Pink with hints of blue, and I just love this. Okay, let us move this so that we can see the cool. It says. The oh, it says the heart is not a. Let me let me make sure that this is showing to the camera. It says the heart is not a weakness, and you are so right. Like oh my god, <laughs> I have a new mug, another another travel mug. <laughs> this I am going to keep. I'm keeping with the box. Like I'm definitely grabbing this. I'm taking this. This will be my official travel mug, right? The other mug is always. I would have brought it out to show you on camera, but that one is always at work. It's my work mug. This is going to be my official travel mug. Oh my god, fairy loot, thank you. And there again, I go just <laughs> going straight into the box. And I once again forgot my intro. Fairy loot is a YA subscription box that um sends it's a monthly YA subscription box where every month you get a brand new YA release alongside three to five bookish items. I've been subscribed to Fairy Loot for years now. Um, but this box I am unboxing was sent to me by the amazing people at Fairy Loot for free for an honest review. And as we can all see, it's all to a great fantastic start. <laughs> <laughs> okay, fine. Noria, calm down. Calm the. F calm down. Okay. Next item in the box is this. Wait, oh, because it just occurred to me that um once again it seems like the spoiler card is going to be at the bottom of the box because i've not yet seen it yet but i think it's something about revolution which fits because the next item is an enamel pin. It's a puppy war enamel pin. <gasps> Oh my! It's my girl, Rin. 
it's my girl Rin and I oh this is so pretty she says I don't believe in gods I believe in power and you all know the Poppy War trilogy the Poppy War trilogy is one of my favorite series except for book three I was a bit disappointed in book three it was still a good book three stars I talked about it um in my most disappointing reads of 2020 video um which is up on my channel I'll drop the link in the description bar so that you can go check that out but anyway I do do love the Poppy War series and at least the first two books like Poppy War and Dragon Republic were mm -hmm, spectacular and this is my girl Rin <laughs> my baby my baby um so yes I have an animal animal pin from Poppy War the next item in the box is this it's uh it looks like a microfiber cloth right it's a Vic, it's a Vihi short book. It says the world resists when you break its rules. And this is what it looks like. Now, interestingly enough, I actually do not know which V E shop this is from. Um, but Victoria does write a lot of revolution themed books, except for her Invisible Life of Adela Rue. Although technically, we can say that the reason why Adela Rue made the vow that she did was because she was trying to break the shackles of non society. But anyway, this could be from Vicious. This could be from um, is that duet um, duology? This could be from her. Shades of Magic series, I'm not sure, but microfiber and cloth, I am always happy about because whether it's cleaning my computer screen or my TV screen or even my glasses, they come in very handy. And I actually always go, like anytime I go to the supermarket, I always grab like extra microfiber cloths. So I have a lot, but I don't have a lot that her bookish thing. So she pretty, I think this is just, I'm going to dedicate this to like my laptop she pretty she pretty okay so next item is oh my god oh my lord look at this book oh my lord look look at damn it's like it's like full leather like it she feels so fucking good it's a journal not a journal it's a notebook and it says from um it says from Blood and Ash We Will Rise. So I'm guessing this is Blood and Ash by Jennifer L. Amonth Trapped. That's a series I still haven't read yet. And I am just like, like, oh my God, look at that. Ah, it's a journal. Oh my God, it's a, it's a book journal. Oh, it's a book journal. It's a reading, like, look at it. It's a reading journal. It's a reading journal. It, it is pretty interesting very very interesting now i don't know when i will use this because you all might not know this but i my very good friend Brittany over at melanin eclectic is brilliant and creative and she also has a reading journal series that she started releasing last year i got last year's journal and i also got this year's journal it's on its way to me and um I already have a reading journal so I think what I'm going to do because one of my very good friends um, Dale would love this like she would absolutely love this so I think I am going to be giving this to Dale because I already have a reading journal and it is so pretty I think she would love it so but like this is so pretty though Wow talk about gorgeous like gorgeous look at that she's gorgeous this also came in the box it says rage of dragons wash it hey it is a wash it hey Ooh. i like oh the last i think i can't remember there was a video not too long ago when i was asking and begging fairy Lou to give us one more washi tape because they, they did they did put a washi tape in a box i think like a year and a half ago and now we have another one look at it isn't it pretty okay hold up let me see let me see like the best way to give you a view of this right isn't she lovely she pretty pretty oh my god i love the design like this is gorgeous thank you fairy Lou. you all Ever since I started bullet journaling, I have been collecting washi tapes. So anything that would help my bullet journaling endeavors are a big deal for me. So washi. Next are the next set of tarot cards. And these are the seven and eight of pentacles. Um, last month, la October's box, we 
got Tarasai and Dio from Ray Bearer. Um, these are another set of characters. I do not think this is still from Ray Bearer because nah. So this is I remember I mentioned last time that like it's probably going to either be from a river of royal blood or a song of wraith and ruin or um gilded ones so i don't think this is gilded ones though but let's see when we check the spoiler card we'll be able to know the truth there they are and this is the spoiler card vengeance is yours i thought it was about revolution but it's about vengeance oh my god then that means the microfiber cloth is definitely from vicious because vicious is the ve short book that is basically about vengeance i mean the second book in that series is literally titled vengeance so it's probably from vicious um this is the spoiler card we will look at it we'll look at it after we're done looking at the book and here is the book here is the book <laughs> this book but my spirit was like hold up noria hold up you do not know you just might be surprised that i was okay so first here is the the bookmark that is inspired by this um the, by the spoiler card art here is the fairy scoop next month's theme is dance with death you all know <laughs> death is one of my favorite characters to encounter in a box and Dance with death. <gasps> As we dance with the devil tonight, don't you dare look at him in the eye. As we dance with the devil tonight. Breaking Benjamin, I love that band. Um, Dance with death. This is the art and the author's, the art at the reverse end of the author's letter. I cannot wait to read this letter, but look at her. But as we already established, the book is Jade Fire Gold. June Seattle, this is the one that was inspired by Avatar The Last Airbender. Mm -mm -mm -mm. This was one of my anticipated books of 2021, y'all. It was in that video and I have the book in my hand. It says, her destiny is revenge. Yes. Ooh. This is the girl I have to put my faith in. This is the girl who would help me get my throne back. This is the girl who would either be my salvation or the damnation of the entire world. Oh, look at the stenciled edges. Look at the stenciled Um, the synopsis says, in an empire on the brink of war, Han is no one with no past and no family. Alton is a lost heir, his future stolen away as a child. When they meet, Alton sees in Anne a path to reclaiming the throne. Anne sees a way to finally unlock her past and understand her lethal magical abilities, but they may have to pay a far deadlier price than Ida could have imagined. Girls of Paper and Fire meets a song of written ruin in June Seal Tan's stunning debut, where ferocious action, shadowy intrigue, rich magic, and a captivating slow burn romance collide. And Joan, he who wrote The Senate of the Crane and The Ones We Are Meant to Find, said it's beautifully rendered. Oh! god i love arches arches just make me think sexy thoughts sexy thought i blame it on legolas i blame it on legolas look at look at this archer this is just beautiful this is such a beautiful book ah, and this is oh my lord oh my god like look at this this is the art on the reverse dust jacket this is the art on the reverse dust jacket. She is stunning. Oh my God. Oh my God. And of course it is, um, of course it's signed, right? All fairy loot books are signed by the author, so. 
I am so excited for this. November 2021 spoiler card. For the first time ever, we are including a book review notebook. This is perfect for keeping track of the books you've read and for noting down your thoughts on them. It features a beautiful design by Achati Nora and is inspired by the Blood and Ash series by Jennifer L. Amentrap, which I did state. Um, to decorate your new book or any of your journals, we've included a forward washi tape inspired by The Rage of Dragons by Evan Winter, designed by Adblanca Del Design. Clean in style with this microfiber cloth inspired by Vicious by V.E. Shrub, which was designed by Art Stella Bukishan. I said it was vicious. Because when it was just vintage, I was like, that is so vicious. Um, need a drink on the go? Use this beautiful bamboo travel mug inspired by the book of the month, which you would find out more, which you would find out more about below. Design has done an amazing job designing the mug, and we hope you love it. At Salty's designed the stunning enamel pin portraying rain from the poppy wall by Arif Kwong. We hope the pin will be a beautiful addition to your collection. This month's collectible tarot cards are the seven and eight of pentacles. They are designed by At Igians and feature Malik and Karina. A song of eight and ruin. So that is the November unboxing. My favorite item. I'm certain nobody surprised. The mug, the travel mug, the bamboo biodegradable travel mug Mwah! spectacular second favorite item is definitely the animal pin i already love animal pins then you combine it with being from one of my favorite series yes with my, one of my favorite characters like featuring one of my favorite characters thank you and of course the the reading notepad like notebook gorgeous the book is gorgeous like this box interestingly enough has a lot of high points for me if i was forced to pick something that is like my least favorite item because like he also has the washi tape like nah this box is and i love i always i always love microfiber clothes when you have glasses and you have a lot of gadgets and electronic with shiny screens fiber microfiber cloths are a godsend so i i love this box i love all the items in this box definitely one of my favorite boxes that i've gotten from fairy Lou. let me know in the comments which of these items you absolutely love like tell me you don't love that mug tell me that coffee mug is not just perfect that is it for the unboxing um let me know your thoughts as always if you enjoyed this video please do not forget to give it a big thumbs up check out my other videos so i will see you next time i'm, I'm trying to i'm slowly getting back into making videos again um i i still feel the twinges of a burnout but it's i think the time and the break i've taken have actually helped to ease some things so i am forever grateful for that um so yes i will see you hopefully next week right until next time stay passionate stay nerdy stay loving yourself